This weekend, more than 700 people gathered to remember the life of West Valley High School student, 17-year-old Sophie Hawley. Sophie died December 20th from complications after her third open heart surgery. Tonight, her parents are finding comfort in the support from friends, family, and strangers. Sophie dreamed of being a pediatric nurse. A scholarship fund in her honor is now quickly growing to support other kids pursuing a career in the medical field. Our Annie Bishop is live in studio with more on her legacy. And with her beautiful smile and compassionate heart, it's easy to see why so many people love Sophie Hawley. She was special, and now she will re be remembered for decades to come. Sophie Hawley was full of so much life. This memorial video capturing her infectious smile and spirit and the sweet, simple moments her parents now hold so close to their hearts. She, you know, she really was special. Uh, and, you know, every kid's special. And she just had something about her, the way she carried herself. Sophie was born with a congenital heart disease called aortic stenosis, the disease requiring Sophie to have open heart surgery at just 20 months old and at seven years old. After her second surgery, Sophie knew she wanted to be a pediatric nurse. She was taking medical classes in high school. She was volunteering at the hospital. On December 20th, Sophie had her third open heart surgery. There were complications and she didn't survive. Barian. Your daughter's not easy. Her parents now finding comfort through the generosity of others. They've set up a scholarship fund, and in just five days, they've raised more than $43,000. Our hope is that instead of one nurse that Sophie would have been helping hundreds of people through her lifetime, that this scholarship can create hundreds of nurses helping thousands of people. Chad and Gina Hawley believe their daughter's purpose in life was to help others. This scholarship is making all of that possible. One day when I'm old and I'm in a hospital, a nurse recognizes the last name of Hawley on my wristband and asks me if, if I know who Sophie Hawley is because she remembers that scholarship that she was giving, you know, and, and that would be very special to us. And if you'd like to donate to the scholarship fund, we've put a link on our website at kxly.com. We also want to thank Gina and Chad for opening up their home today and sharing their story about Sophie during this very difficult time. Reporting live, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 News.